So in a prior video, um, I did a demonstration of how the Press Reader app is almost the killer app for a device like the Books Note Max. It's just perfect in displaying newspapers and magazines on this really large screen. Um, so I really encourage anyone who has a Note Max to take a look at that app. I wanna add to that conversation a little pro tip. Now, as you go through newspapers and magazines, you may come across situations where you wanna write on the screen and Press Reader does not allow you to do that. You can see it's not acknowledging my stylus input at all. But let's say I wanna you know, interact with this crossword puzzle. Um, how can I do that? Well, that's what this pro tip is all about. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and make this bigger so it's nice and easy to work with, like so. The next step is a touch tricky, I have to admit. I'm going to gently swipe down on the top bar to pull up the system menu, but simultaneously I want to prevent the crossword from dropping down and the app will think I'm swiping down. So I'm going to push my finger up at roughly the same time, and hopefully if it all works out, I'll get the system tray with my crossword still on the image. Let's take a look. Okay, we got it. Took me a few tries, but was finally able to get it. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this free mark button here. And you'll notice that this menu will come up. I'm gonna go ahead and put a little scribble on there. And that's just so when I click on this little save icon, it will know that to save it as an image. Now I'm gonna go ahead and get out of this, and because I'm in Freemark, it's also gonna X me out of Press Reader. So we'll go back into Press Reader in just a second, but let me go ahead and swipe out. And now I'm gonna click on this little disk icon and look into my images folder. And there is the image that we just took right here. So I'm gonna click on that and it's gonna open a Neo Reader, voila. So now I can go ahead and interact. Like so. And I can write uh, anything I want on top of this image. Now the beauty of having this as a separate image is I can then go back into Press Reader, for example, if I wanted to go back and forth to look at the answer key. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go back to the home screen. I do need to reopen the Press Reader app because it closed down because of the free mark. I'm gonna go ahead and go back into that newspaper. It will remember what page I was on. So there we are. I'm gonna go ahead and swipe over because on the next page is the answer key. So we're gonna go ahead and make that nice and big, like so. And now what I can do is if I swipe from the lower um, bottom, I have it set to go into the task manager menu, like so. So I can switch now between Neo Reader, where I'm writing my guesses, and then the actual Press Reader app, which has the answer key. And that's a way that you can then interact and basically do the crossword puzzle um, and be able to check answers and do whatever you wanna do. So that's a great example of how you can get touch input and drawing capability on newspapers and magazines, in this case, for a crossword puzzle.